In the future, Italy will be the first country in Europe to require all employees in the private and public sectors to have vaccination or negative corona tests in order to carry out their work. The government of Prime Minister Mario Draghi decided on Thursday to extensively expand the so-called Green Pass. Those who cannot show a certificate are no longer allowed to go to work in offices, authorities, shops or restaurants from October 15th. With the measure, Draghi wants to change vaccination opponents and doubters. In Italy, 75% of people over the age of 12 have been vaccinated by Thursday. Draghi pushed through the new decree despite protests from the trade unions and parts of the right-wing parties. In the consultations with the head of government, they unsuccessfully demanded that COVID tests should remain free as an alternative to vaccinations. It shouldn't be that you have to pay to go to work, they said. Draghi's cabinet, however, only decided on price caps. Adults may pay a maximum of 15 euros per, per test, children 8 euros. Violation of the rules should be punished severely. Anyone who does not have a green passport, including the EU Corona certificate, and therefore does not appear for work, may be released without payment in public institutions after five days, in the private sector immediately. In some areas, such as schools, the Green Pass is already compulsory. Employers who do not carry out controls face fines of up to 1,500 euros. The new decree will apply from October 15th to December 31st. The corona emergency still officially applies in Italy until the end of the year. And I'll see you in my next video. Bis gleich.